Matt Goodwin, EliteFTS.com Equipment Sales. We're looking at the posterior chain developer. This is shown with the Extreme logo package. So you'll see laser logos on the sides, laser logo out in front on the pendulum, and then laser logo on the back of the foot plate. With the Extreme logo package, you will have your choice of these laser cut logos. If you do not get the Extreme logo package, this will come with a vinyl logo on the sides. It'll come with Elite FTS, but again, we can customize that. That's built into the price, so if you want your own logo on these, we can do those on the vinyl as well. So this particular unit is a posterior chain developer, and the reason why we call it that is because it's multi-use. It will come with band pegs throughout the bottom of the unit, as well as the step-up area, so you have different levels for band tensions. The arms on this are adjustable, so they'll adjust in and out for you. So the foot pads are adjustable. You can adjust those up or down um, to kind of get yourself the right fitting. Depending on the exercise that you're doing, you may need it higher, you may need it lower. Um, so that, that, this is completely adjustable for you as well. The foot plate, again, is gonna be very easily adjusted. It's got the handle on the back here, and then we have a foot pedal. And all you do is you step down on the foot pedal, it releases, and then this will rotate forward or backwards for you. Please note, when you do purchase this, this comes shipped exactly the way you're seeing it right now. So there is no assembly for this thing. It is completely welded, put together, and ready for use. So when you get it, make sure you have plenty of people to help you assist to get this off the truck inside your facility or your house or your basement. Uh, but this is a solid weld. It does not come apart, and it is very big and cumbersome. Um, so just keep that in mind when you buy these. Um, you might want to make sure you have a little... A, wider than normal door, um, a bay door would be easier, sliding door, something of those sorts. Uh, it is a very large, heavy unit. So we're gonna have Mason here demonstrate some different movements that you can use on this piece. Um, everything from posterior chain movements to actually some upper body movements, which is really kind of cool. So we'll go ahead and um, show you some different um, potential movements with this. 